Hey guys, welcome to Tony's How To's. In this video, I'm going to show you how to download and install EA Sports FC24 on your laptop or PC. So before we start, hurry up and check out our latest offer just under this video. So let's get started. So first thing that you want to do here is we want to install an application wherein we'll be able to install and buy different games. So in this case, it's going to be Steam. So go to any browser, go to Google, and just search for the following, which is going to be Steam. Now from here, you should be able to see the link for Steam. So it's going to say, welcome to Steam. Go ahead and click on it. And at the top right section, you should be able to see a section that says install Steam. And from here, just go ahead and just install Steam in your PC. So Steam is very cool. You could basically buy different games, install different games. They have free games here if you want to as well. Now, once you've installed Steam, it's very easy. You just need to create your account and all of those stuff. So if you want to create your account and have the tutorial for that, we have a video for that. So make sure to visit our channel. Now, from here, you want to go ahead and go to Steam. So once you've created your account, installed it, you should be able to see this UI here. Now, in Steam, how do you actually install or download the EA Sport FC? So at the store section here at the top left, you should be able to just click on it. Go to the search section at the top right and you want to basically type in the uh, section or the game that you want to buy. So in this case, it's going to be EA Sports. Let's just go ahead and go to eSports FC here and you should be able to see the game. So go ahead and click on it. Now, for EA Sports, it's actually cost around 2,000 Philippine Peso, but it might be different for you if you're living in a different country or a different region. So it depends. So right now, this is the, it, it actually costs right now. So if you want to buy it, just click on Add to Cart. And under Add to Cart, you'll be able to either purchase this for yourself or gift this to another friend if they are in Steam. Now, if you want to buy it, just click on Purchase for Myself. And from here, you'll be able to choose the payment method. So you have PayPal, Visa, MasterCard, and different me payment methods actually depends on where you are currently located. So yeah, just choose the option that is best suited for you. So if you want the card like Visa, card number, first name, CD, and all of your card details will be required here. But once you've bought this game and you've uh, paid for it, you need to go to your library here and you want to look for the game that you just bought, which is uh, EA Sports. So if you have e EA Sports will be appearing here since I already have a lot of games here. I'm just going to give you an example. Like for example, if you have this game here, let's say this game here, you should be able to see an install button next to it. The button here, instead of play, it's going to say install. So go ahead and click on it and it's going to be redirected to the download section here wherein you'll be able to uh, see the current progression of the download. So when it completes download, when you go back to your library here, you'll be able to start playing the game instead of install, it's going to say play. And that's about it. So thank you for watching. If you have any questions, feel free to ask in the comment section. If you enjoyed this video and found it helpful, you could use the link in the description to subscribe. See you in the next video.